in part one I showed you the setup of my Ecodura. I wanted to show you uh, my hopper tank because this is an open loop system so when the water expands when it warms up and heats up it's got to have a place to go but you don't want air to get in your system so this is this is my idea of a hopper tank it's seven gallons it's aluminum it's an air tank um, from Harbor Freight and I put a little compression fitting in the bottom of it come down and made a T came up here for a sight glass because right there's in the house so I can look right out and I can see it um, I put this little piece of tape on here to show to give us an idea of where the level is it's got three gallons sitting up on top of it it moves about a half inch and as you see I cut the top of it off one end of it off so that I can put glycol if I need to put glycol in the furnace now you see that's not full if it's seven gallons I got three in it that means it's got four gallons that it can expand if for some reason the stove did overheat and it needed to uh, get rid of pressure it can just fill that tank up as the pressure bubbles through uh, the glycol and release the pressure without losing all my glycol so it's kind of an expansion tank but on an open loop and that's the only time you'd ever need that expansion I actually tried to build one this is my first attempt and it didn't work well um, the heat uh, it did get hot because I didn't have the air out of the system and it actually uh, warped this tank because uh, it couldn't handle the heat so I didn't want rust in it so there's $59 expansion tank no biggie not hard to build any questions let me know and chap out